号请上台，六号请准备，八号请收听。Good morning. My name is Roy. The story I'm going to share with you is Sally's homesick. Sally is 19 years old. She has always lived with her parents. Now it is time for her to go to college in another place. She wanted to be a doctor in the future. Her mom. Was very sad about this. She was also afraid because she loved her daughter very much. She thought my little girl will be alone for the first time in her life. There is no one she knows. There is nobody to talk to, and no one to look after her. Perhaps she will be in trouble or feel sad because she isn't with us. Sally said goodbye to her father and to her cats, and promised to call her parents every night. Then her mother took her to the college by train. When they said goodbye, her mother cried. On her way back home, she cried again. Sally kept her promise. Every week, she called home. She talked with her parents for several minutes. Sally was always very happy and never said that. She missed her parents. Her mother was not happy about this. She thought perhaps she thinks the college is nicer than her home. Then winter came and the school holidays were coming soon. That week, Sally called her parents and said, "The students here were talking yesterday evening." They said, "We are happy that we can return home again for a few days." Sally's mother was very glad that the students had said this. She must really miss us, she thought. Then she asked, "Did you say that too?" "Oh yes," Sally answered. "We all say that it's easy to speak to our parents on the phone every week, and that we really miss our pets." Thank you.